There is a five in there. No way. <laughs> no. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. Oh my gosh, it's huge. 152 to 165. It's a guaranteed diamond. So, I have not had a whole lot of luck uh, hunting the kudu. Basically what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to hunt kudu at this zone that uh, Mel told me about. I believe she made a, a video about it as well. This rest zone for kudu, uh, there's tons of, tons of lesser kudu at this zone. So I've been server hopping and seeing what I can find. I haven't had any luck finding a five or any rares, but right there, that little guy, if I can get a spot, right there is a one trivial male lesser kudu, and uh, he looks tiny, so I think I'm going to shoot him and see if maybe he's a minimum weight kudu. That would be really funny. I think that's the first one trivial male I've seen. So I'm going to shoot him, and then I'm just going to kind of watch them all kind of go up the slope and uh, take off as they flee just to see there's anything interesting in there that I'm missing but bang that should do it and then quickly get up here and make sure there's nothing good in there and there's just a ton of them at this zone man it's really cool oh they're gone wow okay they're dipping quick that's a pretty big four holy holy that was a pretty big four only up to 147 you need 151 Point something for diamond. This guy is definitely the smallest male I've seen since the Churax Kudu dropped. Be pretty cool if he's a minimum weight. They might be a little bit rare. Look at this little guy. <laughs> Not a single spiral. Just a couple spikes. A couple bowed spikes on him. Yeah, he's tiny. He's absolutely tiny. Let's see. 64.57, 100 scoring. That is a very small kudu. Smallest I've seen so far, so 100.5, 64.57 kilos. Let's see if we can find a smaller one than that, but uh, as of right now, he's definitely the smallest that we've found. All right, we've got more kudu, we've got more kudu, we've got a three. We've got a couple one females, whole bunch of them up here. There's another three. Hoping to find a five. We got a two. We got another three. Two. There's a four. Going up to 140. Not big enough. Not quite big enough. Another three. So with this spot, I like to get to right about here. And then I work my way up to right about there. And uh, there's a spot right there where you can kind of see off to the left. You can kind of see that whole area. You can also see kind of up the cliff there. And what I like to do, if I don't see anything good in the herd... Uh, I'll just fire off a shot and spook them and watch them take off kind of up the hill behind them, up the mountain. We want a level 5. We want to get a Diamond Truax Kudu today. That's what we want. There's another 3. It's a really cool spot that Mel found and told me about. I'm really uh, stoked that uh, she told me about this spot. It's really cool for Kudu. And I'm hoping it's going to get us our first Truax Diamond. Okay, so right about here, at this spot, this is where I'm going to spook them, and I'm going to watch as they kind of run up the hill here. We can see anything that we haven't been able to see that might be kind of hidden. Make sure we didn't miss anything good. They're actually taking off up there. Okay, let's try this. Just gonna hip, hip fire real quick. Pull out the binos. Just watch them take off. There they go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and there's always more than you ever would have ever imagined. There's always a ton of them. Just a ton of them. But I don't see anything crazy in there. Lots of small males and lots of females. Yeah, a bunch of small males there. We're going to keep hopping. Oh, that four goes up to 148. Not big enough. Not big enough. There's Kudu. 
I see you, I see, level three, and level one trivial. There they are. Look at the true dudes, baby. True kids. We got true kids. We got true kids. We got a whole bunch of true kids out here. We're going to try to get a line of sight. I'm going to keep moving to the right. Can we get a diamond? Can we get a diamond true kudu today? What's that? That's a big four. Well, it's not a big four. 138 high estimate. Not big enough. Bunch of small kudus. Tiny little male up there. A little too minor. Oh yeah, there's just tons of them up here. Just tons of them. There's a four going up to 142. Not bad. Three. Hang on. Make sure we're not stirring them up up there. See lots of males. Lots of small males. Oh, hang on. Don't want to get too close. We don't want to get too close here. That four going up to 142 is not bad looking. Look at this three. This three goes up to 140. I think that's the biggest estimate I've seen on a three. Pretty wild one. Some of these threes look very big. Really, really nice looking. That's a cool looking three. It's got a wide rack on it. I'm going to shoot that guy. And then we're going to see what spooks out of there. You really do want to you want to spook them after you after you look at them you want to spook them because a lot of the time you're not able to see all of them and there might just be a level 5 or something in there. Okay, we're going to shoot that guy. I think the shot was okay. It was a little weird, but he went down. Let's see what we got. What's that? A 4 going up to 147. See, like I didn't see that guy. There's always like way more than you think. So you do, you wanna shoot one or just just spook them out, whatever you wanna do. But you definitely wanna do that before you leave. My gosh, like, look at them all, it's insane. So real quick, so this rest zone, it's a 1030 to 1400 rest zone, just so you guys, if you guys haven't seen uh, Mel's video that she put, that she that she did about this, uh, about this hotspot, but this is a pretty major hotspot for Kudu. As you can tell, the zone starts at 1030 to 1400, uh, basically, uh, start at this this outpost and kind of work your way up. I kind what I kind of do. I start I start at this outpost and I work my way to the right, kind of just to where this little turn in the road is, and just kind of like right up in here, you get a really good view of the herd in there. It's really cool. Pretty big one. Not big enough to be a diamond though. One thirty eight point seven. So I mean the diamonds are just massive. It's a nice looking kudu. That thing's only a 138.7, 151.6 for diamond. So they get huge. These guys get absolutely massive. Tail end of this rest zone. Let's see if we can spot them up here before they leave. Don't want to let them leave. We don't want to let them depart from their zone. We want them to be resting and we want there to be a level five or maybe a rare or maybe a rare level five. That would be fine too. It's not a big deal. It's fine. It's all good. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, there's a three in there. Don't see any off to the left. Wait. No, that's a tree. That's a tree, Casey. <laughs> You're going to see lots of those. They're all up through there I believe so might be a red brown one not too concerned with those right now looking for the big males look for the big looking for the big we're looking for the big males at the moment okay I'm seeing them here we go here we have a big male friggin three all the threes today lots of threes lots of twos yeah, 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 yeah. There's a four going up to 140. Not quite what we're looking for. Not quite big enough. Just not quite big enough. We're looking for a diamond, and diamonds start at 151 point something. But we're looking for at least a 151 high estimate. We're looking for those big horns, baby. Looking for those tall horns. That's what you want for the diamonds. Oh, you'll know. Oh, you'll know. When you've got a diamond potential, you'll know, you'll see it. You'll see it with your eyeballs. You will see that. Okay, they're leaving now. That's actually good. I'm gonna get a look at them. I might even just spook them. I might even just flush them out. I think I'm gonna do it. I think that's what we're gonna do. There they go. There they go. 
There is a five in there. No way. <laughs> no. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. Oh my gosh, it's huge. 152 to 165. It's a guaranteed diamond. It's a guaranteed diamond. Get a little screenshot of that. Okay, hang on. Let's stay on him. Let's stay on him. Alright, keep your cool, KC. It's a guaranteed diamond. All we gotta do is keep our cool. Stay patient. We won't rush any shot on this thing. But what I am gonna do is hopefully we can get up on the mountain here with a line of sight on him. But I am just gonna kind of let them kind of flush out in this direction. And hope that we can see him. And hope that we can get a shot. So basically... Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. They're stopping up up here. Or at least she is. Hang on. So I don't want to take a walking shot. I really don't. I think what I'll do, once I spot him, I'm just going to follow them until he stops. Not going to rush anything. And I definitely don't want to take a walking shot on him. He's right there. might alert him just to get him to stop or we'll just do that or we'll just do that he stopped he gave me a shot so we're we take those we take those and we've got a five medium kudu down and it's a guaranteed diamond as long as we didn't spine it or something silly like that i'm pretty sure the shot was just fine I think he was exactly 150 out. Zero for 150. With the M1. Yes, we were. 150. Let's go. And that should be our first Diamond Truax Kudu. And that is awesome. Uh, big props to Mel once again. I can't say it enough. This, this spot is really, really cool. Um, and she, I think, was the first one to kind of talk about the spot. She told me about it, and I think a lot of people right now are hunting it and finding some really cool Truax Kudu, so that's really, really cool. That is a big one. That's a big one. We're, we take photos of those. We take photos of those. Look at this. My gosh. That... That's a huge Kudu! Hang on, I gotta get a laying down shot. Just in case this guy's like a max weight or something. I don't know, it was my first diamond. So I don't know, but he was a 152 low estimate. Which is crazy. 151 is diamond, so... He went right up to 165 with the estimate. Let's hope he's one of the big ones. 153.6. 101.88 kilos, so he's not super huge, but he's a diamond. We did it, baby. Let's go. Gray fur type, 101.88 uh, kilos, 5 medium. Uh, diamond, 153.6. He was a guaranteed diamond. We hit the left scapula, left lung, left, uh, right lung. Double lunged it through the spatch. And uh, let's go, baby. We did it. We got it.